You know, many Cats fans are looking to travel across the pond and cheer on their team this weekend. But if you're planning travel in the next year, you don't want to get grounded. Of course, we're talking about the need for that real ID. I'm with Matt Cole, uh, the Kentucky Department of Vehicle Regulation Commissioner. You know, Matt, we've heard so much. We've seen your commercials. Have you seen them a lot on air? Um, talking about you got to have one of these real IDs. And the first question I think a lot of people may be thinking, but why? Why do I need one of these? And, and well, why now? That's a great question. Really, what real ID is a reset of e each person's identity. So that's go what's going to be needed for travel with domestic flights, uh, entering military bases, and any restricted federal buildings. All right. So it's needed for traveling uh, domestically or internationally? Just for domestic use only. You will still need a passport for international travel. Right. And I think like the deadline's been pushed back a couple of times because of everything we've kind of gone through the past couple of years. So now when is the, the new deadline to get one? The most recent deadline is May 3rd of 2023. So it's coming up soon. It is coming up soon. So where do people need to go and, and what do they need to do to get one? Great. Uh, we have 32 locations around the around the state so they can go to any one they like. There's no restrictions on those. Uh, once someone has a real ID, then they can renew online. They can renew by mail. But that first interaction for getting the real ID is in person and they'll need to bring some information with us. So with them, when they come in, we'll need their proof of, of identity. So that's a birth certificate or passport, uh, proof of Social Security, which is their Social Security card. And then they also need to bring two proofs of residence. So that can mm. be bills, any type of mail, and we can get them all taken care of. Right. And many people may be thinking, you know, I just went in to get my ID renewed, but how do you know, looking at your ID, do I, do you have that or not? It's the star. Yeah. If, the, if you don't have the star on there, then you do not have a real ID. And if you need one, come down and see us. We'll be glad to take care of you. Right. And, and what about minors? Do they need one? No, anyone traveling under the age of 18 with a companion is not required to have that. All righty. Well, thank you so much for stopping by, Absolutely. visiting us here at Royal Jewelers with everything uh, here today. But great information. But if you want some more information and, and that list of documents that you need to get your real ID, uh, just head on over to visit realidky.com. Stay with us. We're wrapping up the show from Royal Jewelers after the break.